you may have a restriction such as um business account restricted as you can see this is the restriction of a business manager can create new shops or sell from existing shop can create ads and all that okay and then we are asked to confirm the identity here now it may also be ad account restriction for this one for example um if you scroll down here you see there's an ad account when you click on it you see that this ad account is ads and some of its advertising assets are disabled because the business that owns it didn't comply with our advertising policy so understand okay so this is actually a business manager restriction now the number one reason why you get a restriction like what you're seeing here is that it happens by mistake i can say 70 percent of the restrictions on facebook happens by by mistake okay and the other reason why you may be restricted is that you have violated facebook policies that does not contra uh, you actually contravene or you are doing advert that contravenes the advertising policies of facebook so for example if you come to the advertising policies um site this this you are will lead you to the advertising standard or policies on facebook we have so many of them we have policies such as um let's take time and look at it okay discriminatory practices inflammatory content deceptive content unacceptable business practices cheating and deceitful practices unrealistic outcomes circumvented systems policy you need to understand all these policies if not you will violate any of them without knowing especially if you are doing something that relates to health health policies if you are selling something that relates to health or cosmetics you will by all means violate some of these policies if you don't take time to read them so if you're having a restriction like what you're seeing here i want to help you get a solution so first of all log into your facebook account after you log into your facebook you will come to your home check on your left hand side you see ad manager okay so you open the ad manager when you come to the ad manager you see something like um ad account disabled go to account quality in fact this is not even the ad account i'm appealing for but i would just want you to understand everything now if you see ad account disabled it is either an advertising account or business manager that is disabled if you see you are restricted from advertising it is an ad, you, uh, a user advertising access, uh, um, access that has been restricted you are restricted it's a user advertising restriction ad account disabled as advertising account or business manager restriction if it is a page you will see it here if you want to know the details you now come to the three lines and click on account quality or you can click see details it will take you to the same place so click on account quality okay we are in account quality under account quality this advertising account is disabled but this is not the one i'm waiting for in fact this is a personal ad account and that is not even the one we have been using i'm going to the meta business manager if you come to the business manager you see something like what i'm seeing on my screen if your business manager is restricted as you can see um comments restrictions this business account is restricted from selling for the following reason the business account doesn't comply with our terms including section one of our e-commerce of our commerce eligibility requirements so this is the reason they have given for this particular advertising uh, restriction so what we have to do is we have to make changes and appeal so these are the changes first of all let me even let you know that you have to look on the right hand side they are saying under the what you can do section you see confirm your identity and request a review so this place we have we have to um confirm an identity and request for a review and in confirming the identity know that the card that are accepted are um, national id card passport um, voter id card or driving license take notice these are the um, major ids that they accept any id that you're using you have your first and last name and then your date of birth and your picture and your gender these are the things they're looking for okay so you come to your facebook check your name if you check your name and it doesn't tally 
you click on settings and privacy, go to settings, under settings, go to your name, put your first and last name, change them and save. If it doesn't match with what's on your ID card, change it and save. Then come back, click on your name on the left hand side, scroll down and then go to your about section, go to contact and basic info, make sure that your birth date and the birth month and the year and your gender are correct. Then you save them. If they are not correct, you edit and save them according to what is on your ID card. Okay, to make sure that you comply. If you don't comply, your advertising access will be permanently restricted. Now you come back to account quality, then we have to request a review. But before we request the review, confirm the identity and request a review, we have to write a letter. So this is what we will have to do. First of all, let's write the letter first. So you take time and write the letter describing what you have violated. And before you write the letter, you check here. Hmm? See what they are saying. The reason why you have uh, been restricted will be given here. And the reason for this account is this business account doesn't comply with our terms, including section one of our commerce eligibility requirements. So we have to let them know this is what they said you are violated and let them know that you have read that law and you understand it and you are sure you did not violate it. Okay. Now, um, so you click on request review, then um, you click on get started. You'll be asked to upload your ID or you may be taken through a few security checks. Then after that, you'll be asked to upload your ID. So let me download the ID first. Okay. So you upload the image of your ID. Make sure it is clear enough for anyone to see it. Okay. So after you upload it, you click continue. Okay. So as you can see, they are saying that um, identity sent. Then request review. Why are you requesting a review? So come and choose another reason. Then paste your letter here. And this is the letter I have written. I said, dear Facebook, my business manager has been restricted from advertising. I am, and I am told this business doesn't comply with our advertising policies, including section one of our e-commerce or of our commerce eligibility requirements. And I am extra sure I have not violated the, this policy. I've taken time to read Facebook advertising policies in detail, including section one of our, of your commerce eligibility requirements. And I can see I have not violated any of them. I've run several ad campaigns and I have not had any of my adverts rejected. I am extra sure I've not violated this policy and I don't have any intention to violate any Facebook policy. I'm sure this would definitely be a mistake and I plead with you to go through and review my page or my business manager and reinstate my account. So you take time to describe in detail. If your reason may not be exactly what you are seeing here, please take time to write whatever has been the reason they have given and whatever circumstances led to your account being restricted. After you are done with all that, you click on send. So after you submit it, within um, 48 hours, they will get back to you. And after they, if, if, if they confirm your identity, they will go ahead to reinstate the account. Okay, okay. So here, what they are saying is that they were unable to confirm the identity. So they didn't review the request. Unfortunately, the ID card that I, I sent to them is the real ID of the person. So I didn't understand why they would say that they couldn't confirm the identity. So um, this is what I'm going to do. Okay, so what we just need to do is to make another person an administrator to request the review. So this is an account or the, a business manager for my client. So I basically add myself as an administrator and request the review for her.
So I've sent an invitation. So I'll just accept the invitation. Okay, so they are saying the invitation is already accepted. Okay, so as you can see here, this is one of my client whose account was restricted yesterday and I was able to use my account to reinstate it for her. So the one that just has the problem now that I accepted the invitation, I'm going to work on that right away. Okay. Good. Okay, okay. So the review has now been able to be requested because this my account, the identity was confirmed yesterday just recently so when i came here here i have to just um they have just been able to review the record so as you can see we will notify you of our decision within 48 hours so as you can see review requested on seat me the review has been sent because this one the identity confirmation was successful so the review has been sent so within 48 hours they will reinstate this account so I'm waiting now for the identity confirmation to be successful. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe to this channel, turn on the notification bell for more powerful videos. If you follow the process, you will be able to submit a request for review and your account will be reinstated within 48 hours from when you would have requested a review. If you have any more problems, remember to look at the links. We have a WhatsApp link. You can follow the WhatsApp link to WhatsApp us. You can um, comment in the comment section. You can follow the link to our website to place an order for us to have a one-on-one -on -one talk with you on Zoom. You can also take time to look at the reviews by past clients across the world which you have helped them to reinstate their account. You can take time to look at the past reviews. We can help you to, to get your account reinstated. Okay, so once again, thank you for watching and have a great day.